Alright, so I have a returned as promised today to do another stream of Jojo Part 5. These chapters being chapters 79 to 87. And as we freaking damn know, we're getting to the meat and potatoes of Part 5. The meat and potatoes of this goddamn stew. I didn't even... Well, that's weird. Wait, Wait my, is my, my mic appearing twice? twice? What, what is going, going on here? <laughs> <laughs> what has happened? Oh, oh wait. wait. Hold, Hold up a second, second here. What, you, what, what are you doing, doing microphone? microphone? I don't know what this echo is, actually. This is actually really freaking weird. Hold on. Is it because that's too high? Hold on. Did it fix it? I think it has fixed it. Has this whole entire time that microphone bit never done anything? But today it actually fixed. But today it for you know what? I might just echo. Okay, I might just freaking echo because I'm an asshole of a stupid goddamn system. Racking YouTube. Never, it's never one moment where you find it, you find yourself like completely a okay with Jo with Jojo with YouTube. Might as well do that intro completely again now because I think now it's been fixed. Yeah, I think we're okay now. But anyway, so yes, I have returned today to do another part of Jojo Part Five. These chapters being chapter seventy nine to eighty seven, and as we bloody well know, it is getting to the meat and potatoes of JoJo. We're kind of getting to know who the frick the actual boss is because, again, we freaking don't know who he is. He's like completely shrouded, freaking. Oh my hair has gone weird. In goddamn mystery. So yeah, hopefully we get our answers, but granted, I believe this arc is actually King, King Crimson's arc, which happens to be kind of one of the more, like, kind of no, no, notable, not Taurus, notable, notable um, arcs in JoJo. So I was pretty excited to find out this actually was the next arc because, yeah, the internet is kind of very, very synonymous with um, King Crimson. So I always wanted to see what the hell's going on with this, but yeah, anyway. Hopefully now it's very much working. It is, I think. I think now it's working. So I believe we're good to go. So, hold on. Otherwise, I'm a bit screwed with this actually echo, echo because I have no way to fix it because apparently YouTube just hates me. Like, when does it not hate me? That's a, that's a better question to ask. Nah, I think the echo's gone. Okay, anyway, enough talk. Well, let's actually get this show in the goddamn road. My nose is actually really freaking itchy today as well, which is even freaking worse. But do 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 alert me if something does happen with the old um with the old echoing because I probably have to figure figure something out on this goddamn system because there probably is always one way of doing it. Also, 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 also found out I've actually caught up with all the colour scans as well. Like, there's no more colour scans after this volume, so I was like, God damn it, now I've got to wait. Which is going to be inherently annoying. <laughs> I was like, I was having fun reading all of the coloured scans, but now I've caught up, I've got to wait. Oh man, at least part, at least part um, 6 is all complete, so I actually can just run through that whole entire manga, and then get to part 7. <laughs> it is King Crimson. I was like, holy crap, when I saw the volume come, I was like, yes! I was like, yes! It's one of those gratifying moments. You're like, oh my god, I finally got to King Crimson. Of all the things I wanted to do in part five, was get to King King Crimson. <laughs> I get it as well. It is. That is the joke. I think it's also, he happens to be one of the characters that you don't have to read Jojo part five and you know everything about him because everyone on the internet will not stop going on about it. But I'm like, you know what? I'm I'm all right with it because I don't think anyone everyone even, everyone even understands who the hell King Crimson does. Nah, I won't get it, but it's fine. 
I don't get I don't get all the whole entire thing. Anyway, so let's begin with five. I think it's eighteen now. So the Mystery King Crimson Part One. But how? The boss used some method to take Trish out of the elevator. How did he? How? Oh God. How did he take her from right under my nose? Is this his stand ability? That's a favorite word. That's a buzzword in this manga. Is that their stand ability? Damn it! I can't see his face. I don't have much time. It's only a few seconds, or maybe a minute at most. The boss will put a certain end to Trish's life before he leaves the church. I have to act before he can do that. And right now, the boss still doesn't know I betrayed him. The plan of action is an assassination. I'll cut him off of his escape route and strike him down. Freaking hell, yes. Yes! Hey, how's it going? I caught it right in time, actually. Like, I remember the buzzword of the original mangas was, it's, uh, this must be the work of an enemy stand, and now it's, is that a stand ability? I, I like it, it's their buzzwords. It's their buzzwords of the, of the mangas. Oh, man. I'm, I'm hyped beyond belief to find out the hell King Crimson even is. I get it. This would certainly allow him to escape the church undetected while the elevator heads for the top of the belfry. Is it belfry? Is how you pronounce that word? I actually have no idea. It's probably like a really, really incognito way of pronouncing that word correctly. There's a staircase under the floor. It must lead to the basement where the crypt is. There he'll, he, can kill, he can kill Trish without any intrusions. And then he'll probably leave the church through a back door. I must kill him now. This is my only chance. I like how he's I like how he's completely shrouded in mystery. You just don't know what he looks like. It's actually kind of cool. It reminds me of the good old days of when a, when a film would never reveal to you what a character looks like until the very crucial moment. It's always so freaking good. It's actually more gratifying. He's here. Here he comes down the stairs. Now, made it with with time to spare. Leave this place, Bruno Bocciolatti. If you emerge from that pillar, you will die. Well, I guess I get. Oh, it's Bell Free then. Ah, okay. I was gonna say I'm either pronouncing incorrectly or it's a different way of pronouncing it. So it's Bell Free. Thanks. I need, I need to know that because otherwise I just didn't know whether or not I was mispronouncing it. Among other words, I mispronounce this goddamn manga. <laughs> I hope to God someone does, someone does like a comp compilation of me mispronouncing words in this manga by the end of by the end of this because that'd be that'd be great. So everyone's. Someone just great grabs all of my mispronunciations and puts it into one whole entire video. There must be a lot, to be honest. <laughs> sticky, sticky thing. Oh. Ah, ah! He's gonna snap my arm. Sticky fingers. See, it's actually kind of cool. You just don't see what it looks like. You don't even see what the actual stand looks like either. He caught me. Should have expected as much. But, oh, jeez, Christ, what happened to me just then? <laughs> you should, that'd be the greatest thing ever. Just get my mispronunciations, all of them, just clump into one video. Put every single time the driver mucked up. But how did he vanish again? I don't know what he's capable of, but he's he's no big, but he's no big threat. That's much as obvious. Let me hear your reasons. What do you seek? Tell me, Borchalati. You risk life and limb for this mission, and you have at least completed it without any casualties. I have I have held your held you in esteem for your performance. Yeah, I've I've seen it on the internet. It's one of the biggest things, which is no one understands what the hell this stand does. Or like, it's probably like a really really easy way of um of actually kind of figuring out what this actual stand does. I don't know. I haven't read it. I haven't really kind of read into it too much. So, what is the meaning of this? What is it that you wish for? Or has your hubris fooled you into thinking you can defeat me? Has be has becoming an officer awakened a thirst for greater stomping grounds? What the hell is going on with my phone? <laughs> when Trish wakes up, I will tell her that she never had a father. Trish. What is Trish to you? My daughter means nothing to you. 
You never, you never will understand how I feel. Never, never will. I don't know, but has there actually ever been a stand beforehand that makes nothing sense in JoJo? I'm trying to, I'm trying to think now. So, Jono, you there? Yes, Bojolati. I know you're, you're on the move. The ladybug brooch you dropped from the elevator. I caught it on the boss's clothes, I presume. If you're looking for the brooch location, the brooch's location now. We check the disc. It contains a floor plan of the, of the church. We can pinpoint the exact location of the brooch. It it's currently below the spiral staircase in the crypt, roughly two meters from where it landed, next to the pillar. There you are, sticky fingers. Take this. Damn it! Damn it all! <laughs> My phone just going off random, randomly over five seconds. Jeez. Cut off when it, it cut off when it got good. I like how we get a map of the whole entire area, so, that we, so we actually know what's going down and where it's going down at. So when you go to Italy next time, you'll be like, "Oh, that's where Giorno and someone else fought in JoJo Part Five. I remember that. It's one of those. It's one of those moments." Yeah, I don't know. I just, I was, I just read like the constant, like kind of freaking memes on the internet of like, what the f. Yeah, I'm, I'm meaning to get to that. I think I'm, I might actually do it in between the next kind of break in the color scans because I believe it's like um, the next. I believe like next week's next volume scans are probably in the meantime to get that bit covered. Oh man, I just completely, <laughs> completely just went past that bit. So he's moving. I can sense it. The Mystery of King Crimson Part 2. Ladybug brooch I endowed with life is moving away from the top of the belfry. Is it Purple Haze Experiment, the light novel? I believe. The I believe I've seen it somewhere. This isn't a walk a walk in pace. It's falling from the belfry. And now. It's the boss. Oh, it's it's heading for the crypt. It's the boss. Butch Lighty attached the brooch to the boss's clothes and now it's moving. Giorno, excuse me, but could you pass me that water? I'm thirsty. And you better watch yourself, because right now we still have orders to wait on the boat without disembarking. Whoa, the Nancy, you bastard. What the hell are you doing? Give me that back. Oh, is it? Oh, there's no point reading it then. <laughs> I was say, I was either, I remember, I remember read, read, reading somewhere about it, but I was like, I shouldn't read that just yet. That must be after, after the, after it, I guess. <sighs> hey, this is chocolate. How come you get all the grub while we're sitting on our asses here? Damn, there's only three left, dude. I bought those with my own cash. Get, give it back. Come on, it's like we're stranded in the mountains, or it's not like we're stranded in the mountains or anything. Ah, uh, hmm. Huh? Hmm? Mister, you ate them! You ate the whole damn box! Give it back! Give it back, damn it! You better pay me back for this! I thought we were a team, you s- you s- <laughs> What the hell- what the hell is on your face? Huh? Whoa! What do you mean, whoa, <laughs> creeping around? When the hell did you eat them, anyway? Ooh, tasty! <laughs> Oh, is there? Ah, that's a problem. You gotta wait for it to be translated. And nine out of ten times, it takes quite a while. I just found out recently that the Joker game um, novel got translated. I was like, fracking yes. It took quite a while. So the actual light novel's been out for quite a while, or novel in this case. Oh, did I say thanks yet, Giorno? I guess not. Thanks for the water, huh? Chomp, 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 chomp. This is bizarre. Ha <laughs> ha! Let's go home. We've done it. We're go we're going home. We've we don't we don't need any more. We've we've hit it. We've hit the point. We've hit the point. It's it just said bizarre. It's 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 it. We've done it. It's gone. That's it. Let's go home. I don't know what's going on, but this but this feels strange. Damn it, Jonah! What the hell are you doing? We've had orders not to put a single. Fucking foot on the island. Huh? This is abnormal. What well, is this a sensation? 
damn, something strange is going on. Something's happening to Portugalati. Did the boss? Where the hell do you think you're going, Giorno? Ah, oh, man. I feel, I feel that pain. I feel the pain of being too busy with uni. I've had that recently. I've actually just finished, like, about two weeks ago. It's actually been the most gratifying thing in the world because you just have all that time to yourself. But then at the same time, you feel a bit lost because you're like, what the hell do I do with my life now? I've had no work to do. What do I do? John, are you there? Yes. Borgelati, I know you're on the move. If you're looking for the location of the brooch on the boss, it's currently below the spiral staircase in the crypt, roughly two meters from where it landed next to the pillar. But wait, Borgelati, something unusual is happening at, at this very moment. Take this to your fingers. This... This... Was behind the pillar? Oh, this... This... Who is was behind the pillar? Oh! It's me! Oh! Oh! What? What is this? This is the end. So why don't I tell you what you have witnessed and laid hands upon? Was your own future self, the you of a few seconds past, saw your future self? This is this is the ability of, of my King Crimson. I eradicated time and forced it to skip. I shall not allow anyone to... I shall, I shall not allow anyone, no matter who they may be, to threaten my everlasting climax. I will eradicate every last one of them. Okay. <laughs> so... You saw what you saw was your future self, the, the you of a few seconds past. You saw your future self. This is my ability of King Crimson of my King Crimson. I eradicated time and forced it to skip. <laughs> I mean, I couldn't say why people were like, "What the hell?" So he eradicated. <laughs> I want to sit here for five minutes and just go, "What?" Like. So he eradicated the time, which then forced it to skip. I mean, yeah, that does make sense. Eradicating it while, in the same time, kind of forcing it to go forward. <laughs> it just works. It just works. Huh. Huh. <laughs> oh, I love this manga. I love this manga. It's so freaking good. <laughs> I mean, I, I dig actually get it. Okay, that does make sense then. I was going to say, I was sitting there going, no, it does, it it kind of does. Like, it's not one of those things that's kind of... It makes sense in the context of what it's trying to do, so it kind of just... Yeah, it does make sense. I was going to say, it's no point explaining it. It's, it makes sense in its own world. It's one of those things you just don't question it. It's like it's one of those it's one of those um, little things you're like, okay, yeah. It eradicates time and forces it to skip. So basically it just goes, well bam, and time just kind of opens up, it goes it just kind of goes forward. Oh no, well, because I'm guessing if it eradicates time, it has nowhere else to go besides forward. Ah, that does make sense then if that's the case. If that's what it if that what it if that's what it means, in essence, he eradicates time, so it eradicates what's beforehand, so it can go forward. Ah, so it does make sense. Okay, then. It, so I've got half of it already. Then I'm guessing. I must have got. I must have got half of it already. Like I've, I've got the. I've got the like kind of preliminary. The preliminary. Let me say the goddamn word of King Crimson. I mean, it's not that hard to co comprehend a bit so far. It's kind of like yeah. It's a bit of one of those things like what at first, but like oh yeah, it does make sense. Borgelati, Borgelati, hello? Borgelati, did, did you read me? Borgelati, something's wrong. Run away right now. You think? <laughs> you think? <laughs> Borgelati, your mission to guard Trish. Whoa! The mystery of King Grimson, part three. Oh! Ends here. I mean, it looks freaking cool. <laughs> I, I was going to say, I was like... I've seen I've seen predest predestination, which does take the whole entire context of time travel to a goddamn like tenth degree. So it's kind of like anything after that point doesn't, doesn't seem complicated to me. So it's kind of like one of those things like yeah, it's it's alright. So in predestination, he he's born, 
he finds himself as a woman, has sex with himself, then brings him into existence again. It makes a massive paradox. That's what predestination is like. Is there anything after that point? You're kind of like, yeah, it's cakewalk. Like, time travel's cakewalk after that film. Yeah, I don't understand why people do make do kind of say it makes no sense. Oh, oh damn you. Bucciolati. <laughs> I guess it's one of those things that it's 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 whatever you make of it, I, I think. A Bucciolati. I can see you don't I can see you didn't become a capo on blind luck alone. You even attempted to restrain my fist as it pierced through your body. No ordinary man would make such a call. They wouldn't they wouldn't even be conscious at that at this point. However, sticky fingers! King Crimson has already. Yeah, I can I can I can see that it's it's inconsistent, but it makes um, it makes perfect sense. Yeah, it does. It I don't I don't think it's one of those things that it kind of like it messes your brain too much. I think at first it catches you off guard. You're like, what? But then then once you actually deconstruct everything about it, you're like, oh no, it's it's actually not that bad. Like it's kind of like was ever making a big like kind of. Um, Yeah, yeah, I, I, I see that. That's not all he does. Yeah, it's it's Jojo. What do you expect? Every, everyone does something else in Jojo to do something that make that mucks up something else. You're like, oh god damn it. Ah, <laughs> oh, man. I mean, that those two panels kind of make you go, yep, yep. Forecasted. I can forecast the trails left by your movements, the trails of your future actions. Within King Crimson's ability, time is erased from the, from the world, and none can remember the footprints le they left during this time. The clouds in the sky do not do do not realize they have been scattered by the winds. An extinguished flame is not aware of the movements it has been snuff has been snuffed. It is only the results. It is only the results. It is. It is in the. It is only the results that remain in this world. All of the actions you you take in a world where time is erased are meaningless, and only I. And only I alone can react to these actions. I can see exactly how you will act. This is. This is the ability of my King Crimson. <laughs> He's a lag switch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, makes, that actually does make perfect sense, to be honest. So, within King Crimson's ability, time is erased from the world, and none can remember the footprints they left during this time. Everyone else plays out, plays out their predicted actions, but King Crimson is an exception to that, and is able to change his movements based on the situation. Huh. So in King Crimson's ability, time is erased from the world, and none can remember the footprints that left during this time. The clouds in the sky do not realise they have been scattered by winds, and the extinguished flame is not aware of the movements have been snuffed. It is only the results it it's only results that remain in this world. I can forecast the trails left by your movements, the trails of your future actions. So basically he's actually completely in in some cases. So basically in certain cases he's actually he's, a, he's actually invincible. Unless you can get a stand that can see into the future of uh, King Quinton's future, you're basically screwed. <laughs> in certain cases. Oh man. This is like, this is kind of like that one scene in Scary Movie 3. It's like, how can you wake up dead? It's like, because you went to bed alive. It's, kinda, it's one of those things. Yeah. He's actually literally invincible. Christ. All right. Huh? This this ability. No matter who they may be, everyone's life has its EBS, EBBS and flows. And you and you and you succeeded and you fell. With the eyes of the future, I can see the gaping pitfalls in my way. And I, if I avoid falling into them, then my life will never. EVB, and I can remain upon the climax, don't you see? 
I can feel it. Now that we meet, my suspicions are confirmed. I can instinctively sense that we are related. There, There is no doubt to me that, that you are my daughter. And that means if you were conscious, you would sense the same of me the same of me. I cannot allow anyone who can discern my identity to remain in this world. Ah, oh, Trish. I must bury any pitfalls that threaten me, and now I shall end your bloodline. Your life is mine for the taking. Trish! What? Fracking turtle, yo! It's a, it's, it's a real, the turtle's a real MVP of this manga. Holy crap. And also the brooch. <laughs> it, it, it seems like it seems as if it's a bit inconsistent and a bit and a kind of as if you kind of if you look at it different ways it kind of makes no sense. But then you kind of like no way it, it practically does make sense. You like does it though? <laughs> but it's the real MVP of this manga. Like without without the god without the goddamn. Um, Title, we will be screwed. This manga teaches you in life you need a goddamn turtle. Man, the brooch became a turtle. He was sucked into the turtle. It's Giono. That's the ability of Giono's gold, gold experience. He must have implanted the brooch with the cells from the turtle in order to give it life. I mean, yeah. <laughs> when my phone cut off, Jonah sensed the danger present and activated it. That boy always fills me with courage. I thought my body couldn't move anymore, but not yet. I need to keep moving, just a, just a bit more. My mission's ended, you say? You're dead wrong. It's uh, it's not over just yet. I've been I've given myself a mission to protect Trish. <laughs> oh man, here we go. Here we freaking go. I mean, it's it's not, it wasn't as bad as I expected because people make it out to kind of seem like it's the most like notoriously confusing thing in the universe, like almost as worse as Primer of level of time travel. It's kind of like yeah, I can see when people were like like what, but then you kind of sit there going it, yeah, it makes sense in certain cases, but then you kind of just think about it in other cases like does it though? Does it? Does it? Does it not? I think so. I don't know. Unless, unless, unless you're one of the supreme beings that you understand time travel. Like, once you actually crack King Crimson's ability, you actually understand time travel to its, like, fullest. You're, like, the most supreme being in existence. You're, like, you're, like you've just hit the pinnacle of humanity. You, you actually can't get beyond that. That's what King Crimson does. So, let me see King Crimson Part 4. No matter what offens offensive action I take, he can forecast it perfectly. That's a fact. It's like he's skipping through time, even when he's standing well within range of my, of sticky fingers. My fists strike nothing but air. <laughs> is that what is happening first? It does actually sound. It actually does sound interesting. I mean, I don't know. I don't know if I've ever encountered anything in like manga and I made it tends to take time travel like and make no sense of it. Because the last one, I guess, when you think about it, was kind of erased. But once you actually kind of look at erased, you're like, no, it makes perfect sense. It just never explained it. But I mean, I don't think there's been ever been any cases where I've gone like, what, what? So the possibility, it's invincible. He can forecast any attack I make, and I, and I don't even notice notice when he's dodged my blow dodge my blows. Nothing can trump this this invincible ability. Besides a turtle, let's face it, the turtle can actually trump his ability by a long shot. Because a turtle can do anything at this point. However, the mystery is the King Crimson Part Four. Yeah. I can I, I can see I can I can see it making sense, but I can imagine that people might just kind of go, ah, wait a second here, like take 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 a step back here, fanbo, like what's going on? I can I can I can see it from both both angles. It's kind of one of those things that you either understand prime or you don't. It's kind of it's like it's those kind of things you either understand it or you don't understand it. So it's that fine line where you kind of like ah, I kind of get it. 
But it's always that. It's always it's always those two fields if you get what I mean. So his ability, he can he can't forecast my actions for very long. It only works for a short period of time, only for five five to ten seconds or so, only enough to go around a pillar and enough to pull Trish through the ceiling of the elevator and drop down the shaft. Distance. What I need what I need now is to go is to gain some distance in that distance enough distance to keep the boss from catching up to Trish. But you need to find a way to do it. <laughs> the standing gate makes doesn't make it doesn't make sense. Yeah, I don't know. It's one, it's a, it's a, it's a weird thing. I think I think whenever you actually introduce time travel into a thing, it's one of those messy things. That you're always going to be open up the pitfalls. You're like, well, that doesn't make any sense. It's 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 like it's almost it's almost one of those things you have to kind of pinpoint try and travel to its extent, and it just so you actually can't gain any pitfalls in between. Always, you kind of lose it. I think sometimes as well. So, do you want to earn me this chance, please, my body? Please, my body, keep moving just a bit more. I can't let it go to waste. I just need to make it up. Please keep moving until I get out of this basement. So there's one more traitor. Is that right? That ability that somebody created the turtle, the new member, right? According to the intel, his name was Giorno and Giovanni. No, and and he's betrayed me too. Rather, would would it be more natural to assume that the new member was planning to betray me from the moment he entered the gang? It seems he thought trapping inside the turtle would give you enough distance to get away. However, it was easy for me to escape before that happened. It was all meaningless. Bortolati, stay right where you are. Is it is it force or will that keeps you alive? I don't know, but that injury has ruptured your heart. It is a lethal wound. Hold still and rest. The, res the re respite you seek is not on the first floor, but in the afterlife instead. All actions are rendered meaningless in the face of my King Grimson. First, I shall kill Trish. Stay very still, Bortolati. The charge Giorno gave, gave me was not meaningless. If you can for, if you can foresee my actions, I have made I made a prediction of my own. I knew you'd use your, your ability to escape before you before you fell into the sewers. That was the plan. Now, sticky fingers. He, King Crimson. When you drop the turtle into the pipes, Bortolati, you sent your arm beneath the floor too. That was close. Can I take a moment to say that fracking hell, the artwork's fracking phenomenal. Buonissimo. Artwork. Borgelati, I admit that you have spiritual strength beyond that of a common man. However, that won't change the fact that all your all actions taken in the time in the time erased world of King Crimson are without are without meaning. Take this! This is the end I knew I knew it would I knew it, your ability is invincible, but you can only forecast actions for a short span. You can't see beyond beyond that span. <laughs> yeah, that makes sense. You can't see beyond beyond it. Yeah. Yeah, I was gonna say. There has to be something, you have to do something to actually go beyond the time you can actually see. Ah. So you can actually technically crack the whole entire thing. Like there is a weakness to King Crimson. It's what's it's what lies beyond the thing you can actually can foresee. But it's actually getting to that one point is the problem. I guess. I take it. I never. Tr I was never trying to hit you with my sticky fingers. I was aiming for this pillar close to Zipper. What? Now, forecast, forecast my future actions, boss. What will I do in the next few seconds? Look beyond that span. You, you should see me, on the first floor. Ah, was I did, Trish? Damn. Ah, uh, it's getting good. It's getting good. <laughs> I think I think this actual like kind of character is meant to troll you constantly. Like you think you've got it, but it's like nope. Wait, there's more. It Billy mazes you completely. Like it, it's really it's really what it does. Like but wait, there's more. You're like oh damn it. To be honest, I think Araki was completely sane because, let's face it, half the things he's cooked up in his manga so far, you'd imagine that you'd imagine it's, it only comes from. Um, 
it's like you have to kind of you have to kind of take into account. He does kind of make some outlandish things that within the like within the case of everything else, it kind of makes it kind of makes perfect sense to the universe. Like you just you just don't question it. You're like, yeah, it's all right. I think he was perfectly like not drunk at that point. He's probably like, yeah, you know what? Just throw some time travel in there. Why not? Like, this manganese needs some time travel. These wounds, Bujati, what happened down here? The mystery of King Crimson Part Five. He must have be. He must be around here. The boss can't be too far away. I don't know why Trish Trish's arm is hurt, nor why Butchati guard, guarded her and brought her up here. But now that, but now that is, that, but now that it's come to this, the boss won't let us escape. Ah, oh. Butchati, no Butchati. His pulse. How can his pulse be gone? I filled his, I filled in his wounds. I healed him. He can't be dead. Don't let the best, don't let the best, um, don't let the best Joe Bro die so far. This must be Gion or Giovanna. My lack of intel allowed this new member to use his ability and give Butchlati a chance to escape. But I won't let you get away. I will never let you get away. Giorno, it's me. Get a, get a Baccio and the rest of them. We're, we're getting out of this church. Hurry, huh? Who said that? Giorno, I told you to get a Baccio and the rest of them. We'll get we'll get out of this church, hurry. Was there just a bit of the was <laughs> Did his soul just leave his body and go back in? Like did he just leave for like five seconds and go, you know what? Let's go back in for five minutes. Cause it's just like right there, he's like right down there, so like eh, Yeah. It's it's essentialism, yo. Much like great. Are you alright? You're not hurt still, are you? Hurry! Get a team. We can't uncover the boss's identity right now. We're escaping, Giona. Well, we're still far enough. What? Well, but they're within range. Here I can. Here I come, King Crimson. Neither you will ever see me coming. We'll talk it later. Hurry, Giorno. Damn fish, yo. That <laughs> fishy man. It's a fishy man now. It's a very fishy. Hey, that that's Giorno. He's over there, Giorno. You son of a bitch. Get back here. What were you t thinking, leaving leaving the boat on your own? Butchlati, there's two. What what the hell happened to him? He's got Trish with him. What the hell? What's going on, Butchlati? You're one lucky man, Butchlati. No, you've earned this one. F you've earned this one through your keen and un un unerring judgment, and I've been. And even punched a hole through your heart, but you still escaped from my King Crimson for the time being. Even with my ability to erase time, disposing of Trish in the pre in the presence of six stand users would take too long. I would be forced to reveal myself to one of them. Giorno, I barely managed to escape thanks to you. Now I understand the exact reason why the boss can maintain his reign of terror. We can't beat him right now. We need to retreat until we discover his identity or a weakness to his ability, if such thing exists. This isn't over just yet. I won't let you escape from Venencia. What the hell? Butchati, might explain what's going on. What are you doing? Right, I'll get straight to the point. There's not, there's not a lot of time. To, there's not a lot I can explain. We don't have time, and danger is close, closing in with each, er, each and every second. The reason I brought Trish back is because I've just turned, I just turned traitor against the boss. This is the, this is, this is where we part ways. If you follow me, you'll be branded a traitor as well. What? What? I don't get it. What do you say? He's turned traitor against the boss. Why? The answer to that question is one. You better off not knowing. None of you. Are you involved? None of, none of you are involved in this matter. I think you should explain. Some of some of you might choose to stay. Watch your fucking mouth, Giorno. When will you ever learn to follow orders? Even you, you even barged into the church. Ah, oh, watch Latty. What's going on? Are you okay? It's nothing. I'm just a little dizzy after losing so much blood. He put his hand for a bloody. S Frack, man, that can't be right. I replenished your blood while I was creating your transplants. Do you still have 
untreated wounds, then I'm just then I'm just tired. I'll be fine. It's nothing, don't worry. Huh. Did I really see that? And now went through his hand. Does he does he not even feel pain and there was hardly any bleeding either. What's going on? No, it's just my imagination. Vajati, we want ex we want a thorough explanation. Oh, okay. All right, so we actually have an explanation of of um, King Crimson here. So, Stame, uh, Stame, <laughs> Stand name, King Crimson, host, the boss of the gang. Destructive force A, speed A, effective range E, permanence E, precision question mark, growth question mark, ability. Simply put, this stand can skip through time. More precisely, it erases a dozen odd seconds of time during which it can act. During this period, it also sees the actions of others and forecasts esque image. When time is erased, no humans or life in the world will experience this period of time. And only, of course, they will retain no memories of it, either. Birds in flight and the hands of clocks will appear to teleport, and one will not be able to remember how far into the book they have read. It's a, it's weakness, its weakness are its poor effective range and permanence. Thus, it's impossible for the host to hide his identity against multiple foes. Ah... Uh. Ah, uh, so King Crimson, um, oh, King Crimson, The Mystery of King Crimson Part 6. Man, okay. I think we're on, I think we're kind of, I think we've got two chapters after this point. I believe it's 526 it goes to, this, this volume at least. Yeah, I hit Crimson, King Crimson today, I'm actually kind of getting to the good part, I'm getting to the dank stuff for Part 5 now. Hitting, I'm hitting the good. I'm hitting the good stuff, as they would say. You should explain to them. All, you should explain to all of them, Butchalati. We need allies. <laughs> it just works. <laughs> oh man, uh, I like. I like this. I like the smash introduction of King Crimson. Because what the f? I thought it was the greatest thing ever. The boss wanted to dispose of his daughter with his own hands. That's why he ordered us to escort her. He's doing this because Trish is his blood relative and can discern the boss's identity. When I found out, I couldn't allow him to get away with it. I was unable to ignore and ignore it and walk away. That's why I betrayed him. My God, have you gone mad? Have you gone mad, Portulati? You know better than anyone else what happens to traitors. The boss won't let any traitor escape, in fact. The boss's elite guard may have surrounded Venencia already. We need, we need assistance. If anyone wishes to come with us, then descend these steps and, and, uh, and board the boat. However, I will, not I will not order you to come with me, neither will I request that you do so, because this was my own personal decision. You have no need to feel any obligation for me, but if you will allow me to say one thing, I only did what I thought was right. I have no regrets, even this rotten... Even in this rotten world, I still want to walk down a path I can believe in. We just need to discover his weakness. All we can do now is run away, but someday we'll defeat the boss. We will find his weakness. That's like that's like Independence Day level of um, motivation. It's like that's just like the Independence Day speech before they go in before they go after the aliens. Not the sequel. Se the sequel can do one. Fortunately, I understand. I understand what you're what you're saying, and you're doing the right thing. But let me make it clear. I'm sorry, but none of us will board that boat. We can't let our emotions sway us into doing something so irrational. I I owe you a debt, but that has no bearing on this. You aren't facing the facts. Nobody can survive in this world on ideals alone. We cannot live without the gang. Yeah, Fugles is actually right, Fortunately. What you're doing is right. Now is essentially suicide. You never find a moment's rest, no matter where you go. And I only saw, I only swore, fil, fil. How you say that word? Filty? Fil, fil. I can't say that word now. 
I don't know. I love them all. I love them all equally. I think it's. A, I think the Nunch is my favourite, to be honest. I have every single one there. I think the Nunch is my favourite. And fidelity to the gang. No, it's not. It's felt. It's filthy to the gang. I never saw it to you. However, I'm also a man with no place to go and no place to call home. This country and its society have rejected me, and Bortolati is the only. Watch the only time I I feel in a calm is by your side. Abaccio. Wipe that smoke off your face, Giona. Huh? Why Abaccio? Once we defeat the boss. Since I'm since I'm the next strongest, that makes me the next officer, right? Here you feel the turtle. <laughs> the turtle's actually coming. <laughs> the turtle the turtle's a real MVP. To be honest, I like Fugle's character as well because he tends to be—he does tend to be the smartest one there. He actually—he has—he has he has, a, he, has a, he has his brain in the right place. He—he he tends to be that—he tends to be that part of the gang, if you get what I mean. Like every single gang has that one character who has this it has has their brain in the right place. Everyone else kind of feels as if they're sort of everywhere else, but that, that one character feels grounded. I. I know what kind. I know what kind of man Butchlati is. He's smart. He's a smart guy, regardless of what he says. He never picks a fight. He never picks a fight he can't win. And we're gonna get filthy, stinking rich. He definitely knows where the boss's hidden stash is, and that's right. Ain't that right, Giorno? That's why you. That's why you're after too, ain't it? Tell me later, buddy. <laughs> Mister, what's wrong with you people? You be. You're being completely isolated. Where will you go? No, that doesn't even matter. You'll never leave an answer your life. Anuncia, what will you do? Uh, I'm... What should I do? Tell me, Bortolati, what should I do? Do you think I should follow you? Are you scared? Yeah, I'm scared shitless. But just give me the order. Just say, come with me, and I'll give... And I'll give me the courage I need. I'm not scared of anything you order me to do. No. No orders this time. You decide. You better do... You bet you had to... You have you have to be the one to decide the path you take. I don't know. I don't fucking know. But I'll warn you. Stay back, Nunchi. You, you can't handle this. Ah, oh. we're off. Once this boat leaves, you'll all be traitors. Why? This is madness. What are they thinking? All for a girl we met two days ago. A girl we'll never even really talk to. She's nobody to us. We don't even know what kind of music Trish likes. Yeah, I mean, that is valid. You don't even know what music she even likes. She might, she might be into the music you don't like. Then what the f do you do? That's the question. There's, there's too much writing on the fact that she doesn't. We don't know what music she, she actually likes. That might be the kind of litmus test of this whole entire group. Is what music she likes. That's 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 kind of that's kind of the that's kind of the bearing of this whole entire group the music taste of of Trish Trish was abandoned by someone she trusted ah oh, the boss has his own plans for his daughter but that isn't that isn't our problem all they had to do was look the other way I never understand them I was abandoned too by my dad and my best friend they both abandoned me we were the same we're me and Trish Oh really? That's actually interesting. Like kind of kind of sad because Fugle's such a great character. I wouldn't want to see him go because he's so freaking cool. He's one of those characters you just you kind of fall in love with. Like really, everyone here you do. Like you just don't want to see any of them, any of them go. That's why in part four, when Rohan kind of snuffed it, like in that one bit, it kind of it kind of hurt. Ah. We are like, Jonah, could you get the turtle? We should put Trish inside. Butch Latty, could you turn around? Butch Latty, I'm coming. I'm coming with you. Let me on. See, that's why. I, that's why I love the nunchia. The war. The war. The wound on her arm is is a wound on me. Don't order me to stay back. Trish is me. She's me. <laughs> huh? That's impossible. What is this, Bortolati? What is this? Bortolati's body should be healed 
of all the wounds at this point. I've even replenished his blood, too. But something strange. He's got no pulse. What could this mean? Is he dead? Are we seeing an apparition of Bocciolati at this point? Is that is that what we're seeing right now? Ring, 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 click. Okay, here we go. Give me one good goddamn second. I need to find out how you say that goddamn name. It's pro I think it's probably Squalor, but I don't want to kind of... So, uh, English to Italian. Just so I don't get any names wrong this time. Oh, I, I even I even spelt it wrong. Oh, it's Squalo. Okay, that's all right. I was gonna say. I was gonna say, was I? Am I gonna get that name wrong? Am I gonna get it wrong? I don't know, but I got it right. It's Squalo. It is Squalo. I was like, okay. I need to read that once it gets translated. It does actually sound interesting. It'd be too short in Italian language if I'm not saying the word correctly. That's what I've always found out. Squalo, are you there? Traitors have emerged here in Valencia. Their names are Bruno Bucciolati and Giorgio Giovanna. Catch them dead or alive. These orders come, from, come straight from the boss himself. Boss's identity unknown. Stand name King Crimson. The ability to erase portions of time and thus forecast the future. Invincible. To be continued. Didn't have in the right time. I mean, hopefully, hopefully, uh, for, for, I can't even say his name now. Fulgur, I can't even say his name. Fulgur does actually get his time to shine in a different kind of medium because I believe he, I believe him on his own could actually work quite well. He does seem like a really, really good character on his own. Like, that's, that's why I think, at least. Whoop, jeez, I'm drop water. So, 523. So, the G and Guts. Oh, okay. Alright. I can't remember what this actually goes towards. I think it's, is it 526? We've got four more chapters to go. Well, it's 527, but it's not. It's 526. I was wrong. As always. Right, so, Benencia. So, about vegetarians, you know what they are, right? So I'm thinking, are they allowed to eat cheese? That's <laughs> a valid question, actually. I don't think so. Milk products and eggs have to come from cows and chickens. They don't. They can't eat cakes made with cream, either. Really? No cake, either? But maybe that's good for their health. <laughs> At this point, I would love to read JoJo 24-7, to be honest. That'd be great. Like, just never non-stop JoJo. The JoJo hype train just never stops for 24 hours straight. Even when I, even when I get to part 7, when everything gets, everything gets fracking long as well. So it's kind of like it never ends. Ah, oh, man. I should do that one day. Just, like, just do a 24-7 stream just of JoJo. I've got another question. What do they, what do they use instead of shoes and bags? If you don't want animals to suffer, I guess you'd wear sneakers and rucksacks instead. Well, they... Whoa, they've got style. Like, you got grannies walking around dressed like ballers. I don't think restaurants would, would let them eat... Would let them in like that. Giorno. Even some of my words, my throat is going weird. Now, now that it's come to this, sneaking around won't solve our problems. Just sit, just sit down and have a good meal. In the meantime, the issue now is the sea. Water, surra water surrounds us from all sides. We need to, we need a way to get through that. I'm sure the boss already has men on our tail. If we can't cross the water undetected, they'll just ambush us. They, um, ambush us there, and no amount of hiding will, will do us any good. Yes, I know, but we need to stay alert. They might even poison our mills. Splash. Hmm. Hey, what the fuck did you just do? You got wine on my fucking suit. Huh? Fucking kid, what do you think you're doing? This suit costs five hundred thousand yen. You got the money to pay me back, huh? Get over here. <laughs> I know you are. 
I know, I know, I know what, no, not I know you are, I know what you are, what? The enemy, the enemy, the enemy, take this and this, what are, what are, hold on, Anantia, I don't think he's an enemy, huh? Yeah, that's just a civilian, shit, really? Oh, shit, man, I, I can't pay for this, I don't have that kind of money, uh, yeah, mean, mean this? Yeah, this is gonna be a bitch to get out, a wine saying six out like a sore thumb in a white suit. But he's he's got lucky here. If he keeps button, nobody will notice. Well, what's what's done is done. While well, he's here, we'll make him check for. We'll let him check for poison. <laughs> That's amazing. I thought I actually did a ride wrong. Then I thought I might. <laughs> I thought I said a word wrong. I was like, did I say a word wrong? Nah, I was good. Nanchi is a real gangster, to be honest. Nanchi is the realest gangster in the whole entire group. But, hold on, don't miss anything. No, I didn't, cool. But, what's wrong with Butch Lighty's body? I'm sure of one thing. When I touched Butch Lighty's wrist, there was, wasn't any pulse. What happened to him? What's happened to him? He hasn't, he hasn't so much as touched his food. And he didn't bleed when he, when he hurt his, his hand either. After the battle with the bonds, which like his heart stopped. Could it be? Could it be? How is his heart now? Is it beating? Or is it just or is it still stopped? What's going on? I'm worried. But now it's not the time to find out. I can't say this in front of the others. I'll have to keep this to myself for now. Bucciolati. What will you do next? Uh, what, will we, what will we do next? The boss's stand obviously has the power to erase time, and within that erase time, only the boss can move. He's invincible. No matter what you are or what you you try, your attacks are rendered meaningless in the presence of his stand. However, that all changes once we pin hit down his identity. Once we know his face, we can attack the boss himself and assassinate him. We must find the boss's identity at all costs. But how will we find that out? The boss has erased all traces of his life. Trish, Trish has some has some hint. Everyone's been going after Trish, and the boss was trying to kill Trish too. Am I right? I, I about that. I don't like that plan. I don't want to get Trish any more involved in this. Trish isn't a part of this. She's gonna be devastated if she wakes up and finds out her dad nearly killed her. Oh man, yeah, that's true. That's true. How are you gonna break it to her? How are you gonna tell her she was betrayed by her own dad? Butchlati, please come, please keep this all about the possibility a secret from her. You don't have to do that, don't you? I already know. I've known this whole time. It makes sense. I remembered something. When you said he erased all traces of his life, my mum once said she met my father on the island of Sun. Sun. Sard oh, is it Sard is it Sard is it Sardinia? Is that how you say it? Sard Dena? Sardena? Sardena? Something like that. It's not Sardinia, Sardinia's with an eye. Sard is Sarding Console Google Translate Uh uh English to <laughs> Italian <laughs> By the, by the end of this whole entire manga, I shall be a master of the goddamn Italian language. <laughs> so Sardinia. Oh, Sardinia. I was right. God damn it. <laughs> Every single downtime this happens to me, I'm always right. I've heard bits and pieces from my mum when she when I was a little girl. She met him on the met him on vacation. He said he'd be back soon, then vanished without leaving so much as a name or a picture. Sardinia, Venezia, Napoli, Sardinia. A little bit of an island off the goddamn coast of Italy. The boss, that's the boss before he became the boss of the gang, 15 years ago. Could that be where the boss grew up? No, that wouldn't work. As I was gonna say, wouldn't a batch your stand kind of work in the context of um, King Crimson? Would that be the case? Can, could a batch your stand work? But no, because a batch your stand stand only goes backwards. It can't go forwards. But then if it goes backwards, it kind of would be able to predict. It would predict, it would predict something, I think. <laughs> I was gonna say, like, am I having a brain fart there? I don't know.
I have no idea now. I was gonna say, am I right then thinking that? I don't know. I don't know anymore. Sardinia, that's where we'll find his past and his identity. Are you why are you telling telling us this? We might end up killing your father. No, in all in all fact, we vowed to, we vowed to do do so or die trying. <laughs> oh come on, I'm on the right lines, aren't I? I just figured it all out. Come on. <laughs> yeah, replay the erase time. Yeah, that that would work. He would he would actually be able to replay replay the erase time. No. Yeah, well, I don't know. It see it's it it seems as if Abaccio's got some kind of key to this whole entire this whole entire thing. He's he's got something. I'm I'm sure of it. He has to do he has to, he has to be kind of embellishing this whole entire thing in some way. Really? I just thought about it because he can actually replay the whole entire thing beforehand. I was like, would that work in that case? Yeah, that's the only problem. It makes it as if it doesn't it doesn't exist. Fuck. <laughs> I was almost on the right line. I was almost. I almost cracked it. I almost cracked it. It doesn't matter what you do to him. I I want to know my origins, no matter what. I refuse to die before finding out. And Antia looks like she's tougher than you took her for. Sardinia, that's our destination, once we escape from Venencia. <laughs> yeah, you're right, actually we create a paradox more I think about it. We don't need paradoxes in Jojo. That's when it gets gets too complicated. And then we're just then we're just screwed. Damn my throat was going a bit weird then. Again. Is that... Is that a stand? It's the enemy. The enemy's here. There's a shark inside my soup. So that's also a pretty good name for a film. Or an actual, like, a... <laughs> an actual, like, kind of... Uh, what's it called? A light novel. Clash and Talking Heads, part one. A shark inside my soup. Aerosmith. Clash and Talking Head Part One. Giorno, get Trish inside a turtle and keep her safe. Abuchio, take this, take the right. Misa, you take the left. Where, where is he, Nancia? Where's the enemy? Inside the soup. He was hiding in there all along. Damn soup. <laughs> Shark in my soup. <laughs> I want, I want on a T-shirt. It has to be on a T-shirt. <laughs> I wanted a t-shirt now. Oh man. I need I need I need that now in my life. Oh man. Oh man. Oh you enjoy do you find a shark in your soup? Let alone the goddamn um <laughs> That would be a rad name for an album actually. Oh man. And all and the whole entire album will be like kind of um like, the whole entire album just consists of covers of Nirvana songs. That's the whole entire thing. It's just covers of Nirvana songs. That's what everyone does nowadays. Yeah, they've actually been fighting traitors, though. They've become the traitors themselves. It's kind of like... The hunters have become the hunted, as they say. Where? He's gone. I definitely saw I definitely saw a thing come out of my soup. It looked like some sort of shark. What? Whoa. Oh, wow. Aren't you? What's wrong? Damn sharks. Damn sharks indeed. Oh, ah. Huh? Aren't you? What's wrong? Say something. Did he did he did he hit you? Are you hurt? He here already? They've got guts. Take oh wait, I hit the I just completely forgot about the bottom bit. My throat's seizing up, I can't breathe. She, I'm gonna black out. I can't even I can't attack I can't attack with Aerosmith anymore. Here already, they've got guts taking on five of us by themselves. Hold on, Misa, Nuncha can't talk. What, really? You can't talk? I mean, makes sense. Holy crap, my phone will not stop going off. 
Warping. It's warping within the water. It's the water between liquids. Damn it all. What's wrong, Anantia? What are you pointing at? The water? What about the water? You want a drink? What the hell? Holy shit. Look, look at this. His tongue's gone. His tongue's gone. I don't think he's breathing. Do you want to fix him? He hasn't been breathing this whole time. Hurry. It won't work. Gold experience can create new tongues, but it'll take time. What? What the? You you should be right. He's going to suffocate me, sir. Do you have hen? There's no time, unfortunately. I don't have I don't have one of my own. If you if any of you have one, would you mind? A pen. Right. I've got one right here. Oh yeah, because you need, you, you stab a hole into the throat and it creates an airway, doesn't it? Foosh. I'll give this pen life and make it into a tongue. Oh, in Jojo. That way, he'll be able to breathe while his tongue regenerates. I see. So that's John or Giovanna. The boss's mess. The boss's message is this. It's starting to make sense. The new kid is the one we need. We need most. We need, we need to be most wary of. He said. Yeah. Honestly, I thought my clash alone would get the job done. Hey, the clash. I'm. I'm a bit surprised they managed to save the Nunchi. We don't want to take chances against the five of them. I'll need your help, Tiza. Is it T? T is it Tizanio? I think that's how you pronounce it. Tizanio. Are you set up? Yeah. All according to plan. I'm set up inside the Nunchi's mouth. My talking head is ready to go. One by one, we can't be too careful. We must follow the plan. Yeah, and an Nunchi and an Nunchi's own. I can't even speak. Yeah, and Anuncia's our pawn. You were right, Anuncia? Yeah, cough, cough. You saved my life. The enemy's, the enemy's remote control, the enemy's remote controlled, so the question is, how do we get out of Anuncia? Should we take the bridge? Or cross the sea? Can you talk? Can you talk now? What do you see? How did the enemy attack you? Atta enemy stand attack you? Oh right, the water. We have to stay away from the water. It came out. It came out of the soup. Are you alright, Anuncia? Yeah, I, I can talk now. We should go through the canal. Canals, watch There, there was the huge rocky, the rocky thing. It ran behind a building. Huh? What did I just say? <laughs> oh man, this is getting good. I like it. Damn, remote control stands taking quite a um, prominence in this manga, actually. Like, it kind of was one of those things that was kind of um, very, 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 like, kind of rare in beforehand, but now it's everywhere, the remote control stands. So, stand name, Clash. Host, Squalor. Destructive Force, D. Speed, A. Range, B. Permanent, A. Position, A. Growth, C. Ability. This stand can teleport between bodies of water, carrying along anything in its mouth. It is remotely controlled and has a lower part has a lower has a low power, but it's still strong enough to slit a throat. However, it can't enter any closed areas, e.g. a container with a lid on. It seems, its size seems to change according to the volume volume amount, slash amount of water. Ooh. Okay. The nunchuck, what did you say? Huh? What did I just say? Did you just say a huge stand attacked you? But you also said it was in the soup plate. Something doesn't add up. Did you mean to say something else? Well, yeah. You totally saw it. The enemy was a gigantic stand. Huh? Clash Clash and Talking Heads Part 2. Oh man, that's a pretty good spread. It's a pretty good spread. I like it. Stand name, Clash. Remotely controlled walk remotely controlled walks and instantaneously between bodies of walls and rips apart anyone nearby. Furious but weak, so it needs to, to target the enemy's vitals. Hose name, Squalor, above. Stand name, talking head, remotely controlled, attach, attaches to the tongue. Host name, Taizano, below. No, no. What did I... Again, what did I just say? What? No. It was gigantic. How, how big are we talking here? Like this big? How can it be so big if it was inside... Your plate, soup plate. Nope. No, that's not what I meant. It's not like that. Then it was, was it? Then was it this big? Wrong. No, Mister. It's not the size. It. I mean, something's wrong with me. No. Was it this big? Yep. That's it. 
Huh? 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 What? What are you saying? Something that big was inside your soup plate, and it ran on. It ran into the store. No, something is strange. Something strange is happening to me. Am I lying uncontro uncontrollably? When people ask me something, I I say the opposite. It's like the reverse of liar liar. What do you think about it? It's like the reverse of liar liar. It's actually kind of it's actually kind of neat. Cool. I thought something might have happened to my stream. I thought maybe my stream settings might have gone a bit weird, but no. None of your description of the enemy isn't really making sense to us. Let me double check. The en the enemy enemy's the enemy's rocky huge and struck you with a swift blow, right? Nope. Oh wait. Nope, he was hella slow. Huh? 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 Again? Lancia, say say something's wrong with you. You're, con you're contradicting all the fa facts. Nothing you say makes any sense. If it's so big and slow, how 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 didn't we see it? Did you really see the enemy stand? I I I I I this is seriously weird. What the hell is going on? I can't tell the truth. Whenever, whenever I open my mouth, I say the opposite. What am I thinking? Of what I'm thinking? Wait a sec. Could it be? Did something happen to my tongue when I was attacked? Ah. And aren't you? I'm, I'm asking you. Did you really see it? This isn't the time to joke or be joking around. Did you really see the enemy stand? Of course I didn't. Ah. Man, my phone, my phone is not stop going on this whole entire stream. Shit, it really was my tongue. Something's wrong with my tongue. I I can still talk, but I need to tell lies. Get real. You're you're not acting pissy just because you got you got attacked, are you? Huh? No. No. What the fuck is this? God damn it! I'll say it. I'm gonna fucking say it. Answer me. I'm betting you didn't see shit, right? I fucking say. Here we go. Of course I saw. Nothing. What? The hell? He didn't see shit all along. Fucking <laughs> But it's the fact that he he was attacked, and the stand is is definitely in remote control. The enemy is watching us from a distance. Borchalati, we should take the boat out of here right away. Stop, Giorno. We got to take the boat down this canal, huh? No, no. Ah, that's not what I meant. Ah, this is actually kind of a tense fight. To be honest, quite a tense fight because I can't you can't say the right thing. Quite tense indeed. Yes, you're exactly right, aren't you? Let's take the boat. Ah, oh, please take the boat. We've got to go now, Giorna. I know we're all about to board the boat right now. Ah, oh, let's go down the let's go down the canal. What's gotten into you? That's what we're already doing. Giorno, 2 plus 2 is 15. Oh, no, it's, it, it's 15? <laughs> yeah, you're right, actually. 2 plus 2 is 15. No, it's 2 plus 2 is... 2 plus 2 is 5. 3 times 3 is 8. Don't you get it, Giorno? You get it, what I'm saying, right? Sharks are plants. Mount Fuji is the tallest mountain in the world. I'm a girl. I am a girl. Bruce, let's... Bruce Lee's a girl too, <laughs> and so is Stallone. Cats fly in the sky, and it's and it's rainy dry, and it's rainy dry today. Tomatoes are black clouds, and black black fries are black too. My tongue, here, look at my tongue. Ah, look. Do you understand what I'm saying? Is anything stuck to my tongue? No, aren't you? Are you all right? Yep, just fine. Ah, no, 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 no. No, Giorno. I've already said this, but the enemy's gotta catch up. The enemy's gonna catch up if we take the canals. But this is our only, this is our this is our chance. We'll trace enemy and take them out. <laughs> this is when that nuncher do math. That is true. There is there is something gravely wrong. Oh my back. Just clicked. That was painful. Holy crap, that was painful. The boss was expecting our betrayal. I only imagine I imagine only a small part of his elite guard is here in Valencia right now. Now that it's time to take them out. Once we do that once we do that, we'll be free to sell out of Valencia. Let's not take the canal for now, agreed? I was thinking I was thinking the exact same thing. Phew. Thank God we're not taking the canal. Huh? Abaccio, can you use your moody blues to replay the enemy replay the enemy and figure out what happened? 
What? What is this? What was that? Shit, we can't let Moody Blues transform and re replay right now. Moody Blues needs to go into the water to track the enemy. The enemy. Water is water is that shark's weapon. Moody Blues is going to get ambushed before it can figure out anything about the enemy. Damn it, I've got to do something. I've got to let them know that something's wrong with my tongue. I know, a pen. I need something to write with. If I can't, if I can't talk, I just need to write. Mister, get me a pen. I need a pen. Water. I can write, all right. I can write whenever I want. Water is its weapon. There's a stamp beneath my tongue. Look, look, look at this right here. It's all right here. Dude's been acting weird this whole time. You think he's suffering after effects from the attack? You seriously think we have time for your stupid games? I stand beneath your tongue. Beneath your. I stand beneath your. Ah, oh, Christ. You missed the whole entire thing. You missed King Crimson, yo. Man, you missed King Crimson. You missed you, you missed the you mi you missed the memes. You missed the memes. Hey, what's your tits off like? I stand beneath my belt. <laughs> no, 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 no. I can't write either. My writing turns into lies too. What can I do? I don't know. How can I warn him about what's happening? Aren't you? You all right? Yep, I'm fine. No, I don't know what to do. Look over there, guys. There he is. Huh? That's a toilet. What are you pointing at, huh? You mean the restroom? This better not be another false alarm, aren't you? No, no, my fingers moved on its own. Yeah, I saw him. We're tracking... We're tra tra what? Tracing? Tracking them down. It's time to put end to this. I, is this what they were after? They they're using me to lure them into the water one by one. Damn it! They'll regret messing with me. But but how can I stop them? Ah oh, man, no! We're at the end of the volume. We've hit the end. Boys and girls, we've hit the end. We've we've done it. We've 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 got past King Crimson. Unscathed. Our brains remain unscathed today. King Crimson does not win in our cases. Oh boy. That was good. That was good Jojo. That was next level Jojo. That was the Jojo I was waiting for. Oh boy. That was good. I cannot I can't see see when people say, ah, oh, okay. King Crimson makes no sense. But at the same time, I think it's I think it's one of those things that you understand it first, and then throw something else at you, you're like, okay, well that that changes a lot of things and how can it work? And you're trying to think figure out how can one person counteract that. But then I, and that, at the same time it's like, well, it does make sense in its own in its own context. To the world itself it makes sense, if you get what I mean. I mean I mean if if King Crimson was pulled in an anime such as I don't freaking know, like Fairy Tale, for example. If they pulled the exact same thing in Fairy Tale, then you'd be sitting there going, "What the actual f is going on here?" Like that's that's the thing with um, JoJo. It does it makes sense in the context of the world, but I mean, at the same time, it kind of I like the fact it pulls twists at you, so it keeps you on your toes. It, you don't know whether or not you get everything in the one in one fell swoop because it always will just go, "Nah, that's what you thought," but no, there's actually more to it. But I thought. I thought maybe... So then a bunch of your stand could never work inside the world itself either because in the world itself they're, they're, their actions are meaningless. So in context, when you think about it, it's useless. There's no way they can actually be able to do anything unless they actually get something that... Is there actually is, is there actually an object that doesn't kind of bend to the whim of King Crimson? That's the thing you, you have to kind of theorise. It's like it's it's that whole entire thing. Like, what could you? De how could you defeat King Crimson? Because there's a lot of things you possibly could do, but at the same time, does it? What does it work? Because it doesn't seem like it does, doesn't seem like it can. Because I thought, look, if you get a batch of stand, you could probably just get back the erased time. So it kind of counteracts the whole entire thing. But then, say save a batch of stand went went forward in time and going back in time. Then I think that could work. I think that I think that would be the kind of thing that would that would be the kind of downfall for King Crimson. But in context, that it goes back in time, so it, it can't really do too much. Yeah, and, F and Fugle's gone as well, which is actually kind of this is actually kind of sad. But yeah, I mean, I'm kind of excited to see what this actual like kind of thing leads to with King Crimson. I want to see what it does because King Crimson does seem interesting. Said it got down least. It doesn't seem like it doesn't seem like something that is 
kind of very very understandable the first time you go through it but the more you kind of kind of deconstruct it it kind of makes it a little bit more kind of sense to continuity I mean yeah I mean I like the whole way it's going now because now it's that whole entire idea of nowhere is safe now like you can't go one centimeter without actually getting attacked by a stand look what happened just now with Nanantia. Nanantia is basically just a pawn to the stand users and it's actually kind of interesting because really when you think about it they've got nowhere to go and they can't figure out what's really going on here until someone else figures, figures out okay that's what we do but yeah I mean the stakes are now really freaking high it's actually the main thing I like about Jojo in this part is the stakes and how high they freaking are right now and it's one of those things that you just don't you don't really find that one point where it's kind of very much laxed Every single moment is kind of chock full of action or intrigue or like kind of something that might happen to the characters themselves. And that's what I like about, like about this part. It kind of takes what was good about part four, elevates it beyond that, and kind of just gives you something even better in certain cases. Also giving you a freaking um, like stand that kind of makes you go, what the frack is going on here? But at the same time, I understand what you're doing. But yeah, I mean, all in all, pretty freaking good. So yes. With all that said, I have indeed been the driver. I think I'm actually done with the colour scans of this whole entire point now. Because there won't be any more scans until next week. So I actually have to wait now. I'm actually kind of caught up. Which is depressing because now I have to actually kind of um, wait for it. It has been quite good to catch up with the colour scans. So yeah. If you have enjoyed it, then do leave a like. Because indeed, it does have quite a bit. If you have enjoyed what I do here and you want to stay a little bit longer then do leave a sub because indeed it does help me quite a bit but until next time i shall see you guys later bye for now